so I just got home from work like not that long ago and today was a pretty interesting day at work um before I start and like say anything my shirt goes for everybody out there but it kind of has to do with what happened today at work but check it out no cam Bo hate us <laughs> but um so at work um you know I was being a nice person like a nice employee sales associate slash cashier whatever and so I was fixing clothes on this table and there's this girl that came in and I was being nice and I was like hi welcome to styles or whatever you know the usual thing I always say and she didn't even smile at me she looked at me and she's like Ugh. and she turned away I was like oh girl and I saw that she knew one of the managers and she was talking to her or whatever and yeah I get I guess if it turned out that she works there and um you know when I saw her I, like afterwards I thought you know she was like probably someone like higher than a manager or something because she was just like looking around whatever so I was behaving and everything and there's this um, african-american lady that came in you know I was helping her out she asked for, um, for some blouse and I couldn't find it anywhere so I asked the girl nicely first well I'm in charge also of the fitting rooms and I had the keys around my freaking um, wrist and the girl the she, she was white this, the white chick she came and she's like can I have the keys for the fitting room I was like yeah and you know I was getting while I was getting the freaking keys I asked her I'm like hey when I do know where the shirt is at cause I can't find it and I gave her the keys and she just like snatched the keys out of my hand and walked away I was like okay relax Brenda relax you're at work um so whatever I, f I ended up finding the shirt and she never gave me back my freaking keys she left them around her wrist like if she was in charge I was like okay I'm not gonna say anything because I'm usually the one with the freaking keys in my hand and I kept doing my thing you know um I was in the cash register and she was just like staring at me I was like damn like why is this shit like observing me so whatever at the end i ended up finding out that she was a new girl not anybody higher than a manager so i felt pretty stupid i was like all right whatever so like we close at nine and before we close i mean after we close we um clean and you know all that crap so my manager asked me oh hey like do you know your list of what you're gonna do i was like yeah i'm like i know it by memory and my manager she's like okay we'll help her tell her what to do and if you don't want to do certain things let her do it so when she told me that i was like hmm, i'm gonna make her do all my work for being a bitch with me um so usually we do the cleaning and i made her do mostly everything because that girl was giving me attitude since the beginning and i was being nice and she was just being rude so fuck you bitch um, I gave her everything. I gave her the dusting, the fucking, um, the sweeping, the cleaning of the mirrors, everything. I just, like, mopped at the end, and that's it. And she was, like, asking me. Afterwards, she was trying to be nice to me, asking me, like, questions. And not to be mean, because my manager was there. I was trying to, I was a hypocrite. And I was being nice to her, and whatever. And she asked me, oh, I came in at 5.40, and I leave at 9.30, how many hours is that? I was like, girl, like, don't you have fingers to count? So there I go, nice Brenda. I helped her out, so I counted the freaking hours. You know, she came in at 5.40, 6.40, 7.30, 8.40 for like three hours and some change. So whatever, and at the end, I opened the door for her and she left, like, way before me. It was like way before, like, 9, 10? I don't know, but I don't like customer, I mean... There's some customers that are like mean, but we gotta deal with it. And there's employees that are like rude hell as hell too, and we gotta deal with it. But I, am, mm, I don't know. I'm gonna have to suck it up. But I think there's always like an employee, you know, that person that has to get in your freaking nerves. 
but I don't even know why would they even apply at a job that they know they're gonna deal with customers and they're fucking rude. So, fuck you.